From the moment that ordinary colonists took up arms for liberty, military service has been a core component of American citizenship. And people from all walks of life expected to serve during times of war. But then the draft ended. And since, less and less of us have any real connection to the armed services. In less than 50 years, a real division between military and civilian has formed. So what? What is lost when we replace civilian soldiers with professional warriors? And what happens when stereotypes harden about who veterans and civilians are and what it means to serve our country? This spring, the Veterans Coming Home Project will try to find out. A team of veterans and civilians will crisscross the U.S., gathering unflinching and complex stories. We are at Templeton Middle School. Stories of Americans who serve their country in the military and beyond. The biggest thing that's separating the veterans from civilians is themselves. The civilian will never understand. And what can you do? Follow their journey at veteranscominghome.org. When the war's over, do you think it kind of ends there? And starting on Memorial Day weekend, watch for the ongoing release of a series of digital shorts capturing everything they've learned. Is it necessarily as much as a divide as the name makes it seem? Help us to tell stories and start conversations, to challenge stereotypes and find common ground. Civilians want to help us. I mean, obviously there's some that just want to know if you killed anybody. And begin to bridge the military-civilian divide. Thank you. Thank you, this is really important. Cool. That really means a lot.